Hi everyone, I don't know if you can read what this says. Uh, let's see. It says bone meal. Alright, these are rib bones. And uh, we had ribs last night. So, what we do is we blend them up in a blend, just a blender. You don't have to use a, we have a food processor. Bad. Over there, bad idea. Blender, good idea. Kenny mixes all this up. They're, they're, he bakes them in the oven so they're really dry, um, grinds them up, and we add a, like a spoon or two spoonfuls, depending on how, to the dog food. And it's actually very, very healthy for your dog. So instead of, you know, some people give their dogs bones. We have little dogs. Some dogs will eat a whole bone. I mean, I have seen a dog, because they want them so bad, just swallow a whole bone. So to get the, just, this is just one way they can get the nutrients from the bone and the bone marrow is simply just grind it up. We use, and actually people can use this too in their food because there is certain essential ingredients in the bone marrow that you're not getting. So this is bone meal. We can use it in like soup and stuff. It's not just for the dogs, but in this case the dogs use it more than us. So... Um, I'll attribute that to dog food. This is from barbecued ribs last night. And the ribs actually is a dry rub rib that we do with all kind of um, our own spices. Um, there is a secret ingredient to the dry ribs because barbecue sauce is kind of sweet and tangy. Should I give that away, Kenny? Um, the, you know, people, we use a lot of turmeric and stuff, but um, you, you can add whatever you want, garlic, salt, pepper, but allspice, allspice and a little sugar and some cumin is just, those are three must-haves and it'll make it taste more um, like traditional. That's actually one of the, the big things. You'd be amazed. You don't have to use that much. I just wanted to show you what we did with bones for... Um, uh, stuff. Also, I know a lot of people use the Himalayan salt. We do too. I'm the honey addict. Um, and the dogs, if they saw me get the honey out, would want some. Yes, they get a little spoonful of honey too a day. But this will be for the dogs. Kenny's going to finish this now. Um, he started and now he's going to finish. I just wanted to show you guys what we do with some of our stuff. Um, and maybe you could do it too, so you don't just throw stuff away or waste it. It's easy, and it's good for the animals, and it's good for you too. So, anyway, have a good day. Linda's out.